curved line is an isoquant line. It shows us all the different possible combinations of inputs, in this case workers and machines, that we could use to make 100 units of, in this case, furniture. So where the isoquant line is tangent, meaning it touches that straight line, uh, with the isocost line, which is this line right here, then that's the cheapest or least cost combination that this firm could produce. So it's right at B. And so the slope of that isoquant line uh, is going to be equal to the isocost line. So the isocost line is actually negative 1 uh, because that's going from 20 down to 20. Uh, the slope there has to be negative 1. And so if that point right there is tangent to it, then the uh, isoquant line is also negative one. Now the isoquant's slope is known as the marginal rate of technical substitution. So where the marginal rate of technical substitution is equal to the uh, cost ratio or the iso cost line, then, that, then you've got your least cost combination. So right here it's B, and that's how we figured out exactly what the number was.